So it kind of sounds to me like you're saying the ocean is kind of like our lungs? Yeah, that's a good way to look at it. The oceans breathe in and out, and they're breathing out what we breathe in, oxygen, and they are breathing in the carbon dioxide that we don't need so much of. Huh. In fact, nowadays, there's so much carbon dioxide, the oceans are breathing in maybe a little bit more than they should. It's kind of like, you ever breathe in something that made your lungs feel Oh yeah, you know, when you're on the highway behind a car that's spewing fumes. Yeah, breathing in that smoke and carbon monoxide and carbon dioxide. You feel that in your lungs. And actually, scientists that study the oceans are starting to see some signs that all that excess carbon dioxide that the oceans are breathing in is starting to make some changes, like changing the chemistry of the oceans, making them a little more acidic. And we're really a little concerned about that. Maybe we can help the oceans by not putting out so much carbon dioxide for them to take in. You mean I gotta stop breathing? Well, not stop breathing, but we do other things that produce carbon dioxide. You know, we burn a lot of stuff. Uh, we burn stuff to make energy. If oh, we made okay. our energy with burning saying. so much stuff, we still have energy. There's less carbon dioxide in the air. The oceans would be a lot healthier and happier. Okay, I got it.